CEO Managing Director of the Australian arm of multinational companies for about 20 years. So I came into the academic world, if you like, from business about 10, 11 years ago. What I'm hoping that people will come away from the session today is an understanding about what real life leadership is. And leadership to me is about creating preferred futures. And to do that, we need to engage everyone in the community involved in it. So I'm hoping that people will see that there are methodologies, there's future methodologies that can be employed right now, that they can participate in, they can learn, and it will give them a greater opportunity to see what is possible for this region. Most people think time is just the present, but time is actually made up from the past, exiles from the past, if you like, as well as visitors from the future, happening at at the same time. The people of Geelong region have a long history. That needs to be honoured. It's very important that we don't disregard the, the past. The futurists use the past in order to help predict the future. So if I, what I would hope that the people of Geelong could see is that they've had a wonderful past, but things change. And to bring those skills from their past, that same sort of entrepreneurialism, that same sort of drive, the same sort of passion for the area, into the future, and how to create a preferred future for themselves, for their children, for their grandchildren, would just be fantastic. If they continue to do what we've always done, the old saying is, we'll always get what we've always got. So we need to be able to challenge people to, to think beyond the norm, and to, be, become to, to learn how to be comfortable with being uncomfortable to be able to understand that emerging trends and issues are going to happen. So rather than be blindfolded to them, to embrace them. So they don't become a problem, they become an opportunity.